Long before Sir Isaac Newton, Pierre de Fermat, Gottfried Leibniz, or the rest of the crew credited with the development of calculus. An astronomer and mathematician named Gesta Deva put it to palm leaves, the mathematics of his teachers, and possibly some of his own. Gesta Deva lived in Kerala, southern India, and belonged to the Kerala School of Mathematics. This school of the 14th century was several hundred years old. And was led by the legendary mathematician Madhava of Sangama Grama. Jesta Deva wrote the text Yukti Basha, a major treatise of all times, formulating the core concepts of the calculus system. This text has complete proofs demonstrating infinite series expansions of trigonomic functions and gave precise approximations for complex calculations. Detailed in 15 chapters and spanning hundreds of pages of authentication and commentary, most of Madhava's work would have been lost if not for the writings of Jesta Deva who recorded everything in text, until which time it was passed orally for centuries. The Yukti Basha also substantiates astronomical data, like epicyclic and eccentric models of planetary motion, the sun's position on the celestial sphere, as well as solar and lunar eclipses, realm of mathematics, it succinctly presents the results discovered by his teacher, known as the Madhava series. He describes Madhava's series as follows. Eventually, Jesuits traveling between India and Europe brought Yukti Basha to Europe. And thus the text served to inspire European calculus through British colonists. In the 1830s, Charles M. Wish, a judge serving Malabar, published a paper about Yukti Basha in the journal transactions of the Royal Asiatic Society of Great Britain and Ireland. Clearly ascertaining beyond doubt that the invention of the infinite series originated in Malabar. A 100 years later, the European mathematicians who could further interpolate the principles of Yukti Basha were James Gregory, Willem Leibniz, and Isaac Newton. <laughs> <laughs> 